Hey everyone, John Fennell I'm here at Camp RV in Stratford, Ontario. Today's walkthrough video, we got a brand new arrival from 2021. This 378 MVC. Uh, this one here is a 38 foot box length fifth wheel made by Palomino RV. It's got four power slide outs with two bedrooms, one being a middle bunk room and a loft bed up above. Uh, it weighs 12,700 pounds, dry weight, and we're going to give you a nice walk around. We'll check out all the features. So starting right at the front, we do have storage as well as dual battery, dual battery boxes. We include two batteries with all of these units. Uh, and then you do have your propane on both sides, which you can access at the side. Two 30 pound tanks, one on this side, one on the other side, and those both come filled. Uh, it's got nice big basement storage, goes right through one side to the other. It's a drop frame, so it's very deep storage. And then you do have an outside TV hookup in here, so if you want to have a TV outside, you can. Uh, it does have the uh, magnets that'll hold that door open. And then the uh, slam latch doors that just slam shut. Uh, we do have two power awnings on this model. Uh, now they're both, they both have lights built into them and they're both wrapped in metal. Uh, but you got a nice big power awning here. And then another one over here on the slide out because you do have an outside kitchen on this model. With the outside kitchen, you get an outside griddle. You can do all your cooking outside and then it does have a fridge, a sink and some cabinetry and some counter space. On the back, we do have the roof ladder for accessing the roof for cleaning and servicing, pre-wired for a backup camera. We do have a two inch hitch receiver on the back as well. So if you want to slide in a carrier or a bike rack, you can. It's a 50 amp power connection, marine style detachable. Uh, we got two power, or sorry, three power slide outs on this side, one on the other side. So a total of four slide outs. We've got the aluminum wheels with nitro filled tires. And then with these, they do have the more ride uh, suspension on them. So they are an independent suspension and they ride very smooth. Uh, again, you got your storage from the other side. And then all the hookups are in here. So your valves for your black and your gray water holding tank, your winterizing connection, your black tank flusher, everything's all centrally located in here. Everything comes up through the bottom. So you don't have hoses hanging out the side, you can bring everything up through. And then with these, they are a hydraulic auto level system, which we do have our control panel just inside the storage compartment here. And then with the jacks, you do have six point contact, two at the front, two in the middle and two at the back. Uh, it is a molded fiberglass cap and you do have built in LED lighting on the cap, which there is a switch for it. Turn it on. Uh, and then you do have LED marker lights up at the top as well, contoured into the cap. Uh, and it's a two tone exterior color, so a very nice sharp look to it. You do have the more ride steps, and with those more ride steps, uh, there's next to no weight to them, and they just fold right up into the door frame, and door closes over top. They are height adjustable if you're on unlevel ground. Come on in, we'll check out the rest. So rear living room model, so right at the back we do have the nice big window, you have uh, roller shades on every window that slide up and down. Uh, the couch does pull out into an extra bed. We've also got a reclining theater seating which is power, so power recliners, uh, you got built in USBs uh, right in the cup holders, and there's even lights built into the cup holders as well. Uh, right across from the entertainment, or sorry, from the theater seating is your entertainment center, uh, so you do have a nice high definition TV. And there's built-in sound bar down here for AM, FM, and it's also got built-in Bluetooth. Storage in behind the TV. That's above the outside kitchen. Just gives you some extra storage. And we have our electric fireplace down below. Good amount of storage there as well. Lots of storage. You get overhead cabinets at the back, and they're nice and deep. Uh, we do also have storage in the island, because with this model, you do get the island. So a good amount of drawer storage. They're all uh, uh, soft drawer closers, all automatic. Uh, and then we do have some extra storage down below with the trash can location here as well. And then same with these, you've got the slow close. A nice big stainless steel sink, and it does have the roll-up sink covers. 
So nice and deep, lots of room in that sink, but then when you're not using the sink, you got extra prep space to work with. High rise faucet with a pull out sprayer uh, as well. And then for the fridge, we got 18 cubic foot, propane and electric, lots of room in there, four doors. And then you get a four burner stove top. Uh, you do have lights built in the oven. You've also got lights built in above the, uh, the knobs for the stove. But you get the full four burners, and then it does have the microwave up above as well. Uh, middle bunk room. So when you walk into the bunk room here, you do have a sofa on the bottom. The sofa will pull out into an extra bed, and then you've got the lockable bunk up above. So it gives you a spot to sit if the kids want to come in and sit down and watch TV. You got a spot to sit. You got a TV hook up across from it, uh, and then good amount of storage all the right all the way around it as well. Storage everywhere. And then once you want to go to bed, this pulls out to a bed that you could sleep two people on no problem. And then this unlocks, and the bunk comes down to give you the extra bed. We got the dinette table, which you do get the uh, two residential style chairs. There is a fold up extension for that table as well. Uh, and nice big window beside the dinette. And again, you've got your roller shades on all the windows. So give you good privacy, but then they all just roll right up. Good pantry storage here as well. Extra storage everywhere. Uh, we've also got a coat closet when we walk in. So you got a spot that you can hang your jackets. Uh, one thing I didn't mention outside is they do come with a tire pressure monitoring system. Uh, so the tires that are on it, you've got a screen that goes in your vehicle and you can see what the pressure and the temperature of the tires are as you're traveling. Now in here we do have all our slide controls, also your, all your light controls, water heater, water pump, everything's all centrally located. And there are tank heaters in this model as well. So not only does it have an enclosed and heated underbelly, but it's got 12 volt tank heaters wrapped around those holding tanks to keep everything warm. Uh, we do have the tablet here, which you can control your auto level system with, and you can control that from outside. Uh, even a nice feature, you got a switch here, which is for the ceiling fan. So when you don't want to have your air conditioning or your fan going, you can at least have the ceiling fan going to give yourself some good air circulation. So coming up here, we'll start in the master bedroom. Uh, so you do get a king walk around bed. Uh, you've got lights on both sides, which have USB ports built into them. You got windows on both sides of the bed, storage underneath the bed. And then with this model, it comes with two extra fold up chairs that, for the dinette table. So you've got two residential style chairs and then two portable folding chairs. Uh, right up at the front, we got our washer dryer prep. It is pre wired and plumbed for a washer dryer. And there is a light in that closet so you can see what you're doing. And then we've got our sliding wardrobe closet. That opens right up. Again, there's a light inside there. And you got shelving for shoes or for folded sweaters. Lots of storage space in this one. Because not only do you get that, but you also get the extra storage right across from the bed. Uh, you got drawers down below for storage. And then you do have a TV hookup up above. So you got TV hookups in the ceiling and a spot you can mount a TV on the wall. Nice big solid door that closes off for privacy. And they use magnets that'll hold the door in place. Same thing, magnet that holds the door there. We got our bathroom, which with the bathroom, you get the foot flush toilet. It does have the nice big 60 by 30 shower. Uh, you do get the skylight up above the shower, the frosted glass sliding doors. And then there is a roof vent in the bathroom with a built-in power fan. And then with the vanity, you do get a nice stainless steel sink and dual medicine cabinets up above and some extra storage down below. Again, one thing that we keep stressing in this model is storage everywhere, as well as you do have some extra storage in the corner here for all your linens or toilet paper or anything else. And then we've got, with the middle bunk room, it's got a loft bed up above. So you do get the built-in ladder so the kids can go up and down. Uh, but it's actually probably bigger than a king size bed. So you could probably fit about five kids up here, depending on how big they are. Uh, but lots of room up here. There is a roof vent up above. There's a window here. And it does have a TV hook up here as well. So if you did want to mount a TV in the loft, you can do that too. 
So again, this is the 2021 Columbus 378 MBC. Again, it's a, about a, a 38 foot box. It's 12,600 pounds. Uh, we have this model in stock. Uh, you can view all of our available inventory on our website, camponrv.com. Give us a call today to book your appointment. Happy camping.